pressure on that container, you will see that the volume will decrease. This is what Boyle's law states. Or we can say that pressure is inversely related to Or mathematically, I try to write over here. Mathematically, we will uh, write it as P is inversely proportional to V. Here, P is the pressure and V is the volume of the gas, of the container. Okay. Now, after removing this proportionality constant, here comes a constant. After removing this proportional sign, here comes a constant that is called the proportionality constant. It is P is equal to K by P. Now, after uh, moving, after shifting this P on the other side, P into P that is equal to K. Or you can say the product of pressure and volume always remains constant. Or in other words, let us suppose there is one situation. pressure and 
and we are decreasing the volume on the other side and the air gets filled in that tire. The other example you can see, the first example I gave you the white side tire. The other example is a syringe. Whenever we visit a doctor, uh, whenever there is a need of injection, what the nurse does is she will uh, put that injection into your skin, she will apply the pressure on one side and whatever the medicine is uh, in, in that injection, that will move inside, the volume is decreased. The third example is a champagne bottle. What happens in a champagne bottle in that case? We all know that when the champagne bottle is fixed, it is, we are holding it in, in, in like in this uh, position. We are not uh, moving this champagne bottle. What will happen? The temperature is constant inside this bottle. The pressure is constant because the molecules are not moving. It is the carbon dioxide molecules inside it. They are not moving. The moment we shake this bottle, the carbon dioxide molecules, they displace their, uh, their position. They move from one position to the other position and they get stick to the uh, bottom part of that top uh, lid. Cork. Yes. And whenever we uh, try to open that uh, bottle, what happens, the pressure is released and the bubbles volume gets increased and that uh, champagne will move out of the bottle. all about my topic. Can we have the question round please? Can I ask some questions? Yes, yes. My first question is, according to Boyle's law, what is the formula for that? For Boyle's law? Pressure is inversely proportional to volume. Exactly, uh, absolutely right. My second question is, if pressure is increased, then according to Boyle's law, Brilliant. 